I love Quantrix and I want to make you a Quantrix master. Go to QuantrixAuthority.com to learn more. Hey, welcome back to another netcast. I'm Rich Lopez, Quantrix Authority. I sincerely appreciate you joining me today for episode number 330. I'm going to show you how to fix the cannot find data import location error on Quantrix Modeler on a data import that you may get from time to time. Here's the model. What I mean by uh, the error, I have this red dot that's showing up in one of my uh, uh, data import matrices every time I open up the model. And if I go in here and I click on my cog and barrel to edit my query or edit my data import connection. I see this error here and when I hover on it, it says underlined items no longer exist in the matrix. Click edit to choose a new location. But as I look at this, I see it says year 2022, month one, material cost recovery forecast. I've got recovery forecast in here. I got material cost and I have a month one in here. So you can see that this is my category month. And do I have year 2022 in here? I sure do. So why is it giving me this error? I can go ahead and I can click on it. I can see that it identifies what was put in here and I click OK. And my error will go away. But if I were to save it and reopen it, I would have the exact same problem come up again. So how do I get rid of this? What is going on? Well, I reached out to the Quantrix Masters and they told me that the reason this happens is because actually I have a hidden item here and it's hidden because there's no values within it so i would go up here to view hide empty and get rid of rows but what's happening is i have a hidden value where there is a one here and there's a one here and because of this one here and this one here quantrix doesn't know how to uh, it doesn't know know how to recognize uh, where to place any data that would be imported from uh, my data import into this matrix with the current structure. So what I need to do is I need to rename this month here, or not this month, but I need to rename this item here of this category. And if I were to do that and give it a name, uh, say another name, how about that for a name? If I were to give it another name, then what would happen when I save this model and reopened it, that red dot would not uh, appear. Again, this is something that I, I've seen in Quantrix, I believe it's 2021 uh, versions. Uh, a lot of the, this, these errors should be fixed in the 2022 version two release. Sorry, in the 2022, yeah, 1.2 release. Uh, previous to this release, you could see this error pop up quite a bit. Uh, I wouldn't expect to see it here in 2022, but for whatever reason I am. And I've contacted Quantrix and they said that they're gonna fix this hopefully in the next release. But in case uh, you come across this, this red dot and you can't find, and it says there's not a location, but in fact there is a location, uh, know that this is one way that you can overcome it. Anyway, I hope that you find that uh, helpful. And if you have any questions about Quantrix errors or anything else that you're you want to know about Quantrix, I do hope that you'll reach out to me at QuantrixAuthority at gmail.com and ask me those questions because I want to help you learn Quantrix. I absolutely love it and I want to make you a Quantrix master. So please join me again for another episode of Quantrix Authority with Rich Lopez. Today's podcast is brought to you by QuantrixAuthority.com. I love Quantrix and I want to make you a Quantrix master. Yes.